Hey everyone, it's February 28th. Uh, it sounds like there's an airplane or something going overhead, so hope that's not too distracting. Uh, we are officially in Florence. Florence, y'all, as uh, everyone in Southern Ohio or Northern Kentucky might say. Uh, <laughs> my sister's been saying that like crazy since we got here. Uh, we left Venice pretty early yesterday morning, still got like a nice breakfast. Got to finally meet up with Michelle. So um, they're gonna be kind of trailing about, her and her sister are gonna trail about a day behind us and kind of enjoy their adventures uh, as well. I think they're meeting up with us here today. Uh, and um, so, but we left pretty early. We took a quick Columbus photo. We, so we used this scarf here uh, to, we're gonna try and take a photo at some sort of landmark in each city with this. And we did our first one on our way out because we completely forgot the first day that we were there. Um, Anyways, we took a wa private water taxi. Um, we'll 100% admit the water taxis are very expensive, but at the same time was worth it because of the once in a lifetime ride that it provides and kind of like who knows when, if, when or if we'll ever be back in Venice. And it was really cool to see it from the waterways, especially since we didn't end up getting to do a gondola ride because of the rain and just our schedule and limited time frame. But it was, uh, it was Venice was beautiful. And then taking the bullet train from Venice to Florence was a really cool experience. I mean, it almost felt like an excursion itself. I used to love taking the train from Jackson, Mississippi down to New Orleans and just sitting there playing cards and watching the world go by. And it was fun to do that in Italy. And that bullet train got up to like 179 kilometers an hour. So like you just see things just whipping by. And it was cool to see like the countryside and some of the mountains and then some of the little cities that we were going through. So you feel like you see a little more riding the train. It was really cool. But uh, once we got here into Florence, we put our bags away and then we started heading out and walking around. We found this really cool little cafe uh, that was like right across the street from our hotel. And they had the greatest little cannolis. Uh, we've been trying all kinds of different ones. Uh, mine was coconut. It was pretty good. And then they had like this little upstairs area that you could sit and eat your sandwich and stuff and kind of overlook the, uh, the area. It was kind of fun. Um, and then after that, we just kind of wandered around the city and then we saw the cathedral. That thing is massive. That might be where we do our Columbus scarf photo for this city. Um, we're, might, we're talking about maybe doing a tour of that. Today, it's kind of nice that there's no set plans. We're just gonna kind of wander around today. Um, I slept in a little bit this morning. Part of that was uh, I had my first uh, uh, little speed bump on this trip and that I got a massive migraine last night. Uh, kind of bummed me out because the dinner we went to was this little mom and pop Italian restaurant. And it was so good, but like at the same time, it was really hard to enjoy because like I, my vision was getting messed up. And it's, uh, anyone who gets migraines knows they're awful, but thank God it's gone today. Um, I feel the, as my dad and I both get hang, hang, or migraines, I, we both refer to them as migraine hangovers. I uh, definitely got one of those after that, but doing much better now. Stephanie and I got a little workout in this morning, trying to get ready for stay in shape for the games while doing all this stuff. I mean, we're doing a lot of walking, but it's good to do some strength training. Uh, so we did some of that, and then the floors are nice and slick here, so we got to practice some curling slides. But anyways, um, we're just gonna head out and kind of adventure today and hope to continue sharing all of this with you. Uh, thanks very much everyone who sent feedback on uh, saying you enjoy these. We really enjoy sharing this trip with you guys and really, really appreciate the support that everyone has shown. So um, hopefully we see Michelle here in a little bit and then uh, we're gonna kind of wander around the city and hope all of you have a wonderful day back home. Miss you all, bye. 